without further ado, Aida Pirzada's Shining. When's the last time you saw your daughter? Oh, the, 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 other, the other day. Mm -hmm. Really? Why, why? Why are you? Do you, you, you visited the underworld? No. Do you have any idea what day it is? Um, are they still on Gregorian? Isn't that Norwegian guy? That Norwegian guy, Thor's day. Mm, Thor's it day. is the first day of spring. Ah, uh, right, right. The day I get her back from your brother's domain? He's our brother. He's your brother. He is our brother. Mm, no brother to me, mm -mm. Can't you ever get over it? <laughs> me? You're the one trying to press me into the soil. What more can you take? I already watched my daughter disintegrate into the earth every single human year. My mother should know where I am now. It's not safe to go out. The world has been thrown into darkness. They say the world is burning? Well, it depends on who you talk to. Well, what do you say? Everything is layered, like the inside of a rose. One unfolding many petals. Something is changing, like you have. <laughs> For example, I have complicated feelings about Zeus. And so the sort of way that I could make this, you know, patriarchal figure that has been dominating our minds for thousands of years, the way that I could kind of create justice for myself was saying, well, why don't you have a child that you have to lose? And so, you know, I don't necessarily want to create that in, in th this real world, but to be able to break that open in our imaginations and have yeah. to deal with that and wonder what, you know, wonder then, well, then what is, mm -hmm. What is this power structure? What is this, what is this idea if we, if we break it open? And so I think that that's, that's why storytelling spaces are so important because we can break open our reality and then take what we learned there to rebuild the, the, you know, the physical world. Um, and so, yeah, I think, I think one, one way is to do this. And I think there are so many, there are so many ways but i do think that like part of it is that we have to we have to be transmuting and shining brighter all the time in order to really you know make make a space where other people who you know can't see like um can can finally you know see what they can you know more than than finding other ways to ourselves be punitive or to crack down on or strike down on those people but to make more and more space Thank you so much. This was such a pleasure and just a lift to my spirit. I told you, Rodney, like the world around us is doing a thing, but this is also doing a thing that I needed. And so thank you so much, Aida. Thank you to SF Back Co for being the, the launching pad for black work, for people of color who want to express themselves because you're going to be the you are gonna be the artistic bedrock of all of these fantastic plays. I just want you to know that you guys are doing such important work. And so I'm just, I'm in awe. Thank you. Really appreciate it, thank you. And I hope that this um, brought you something that you can carry forward. Um, yeah. Donate, research, stand up for what's going on right now in a positive way. Um, yeah. And take time for yourself. Take time for yourself. It's time for your family and your loved ones. You can take a moment, take your moment. Tell somebody black you care and love, love them. Tell somebody black you care about them and you love them. <laughs>